Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. My name is Rafi Raza. I come from Rafi Raza. My story is going to start with my of my parents, my beloved parents, Aji Abdurrahim Rajab and Aji Sharifa Rajab, and my beloved wife, Fatima Rajab Nikolayev. It's very sad to talk about whatever now, but Alhamdulillah, Allah, Allah is great. The night when my mother passed on was um, I drove her to hospital. She asked me to hit, can you canala take me to hospital? Um, I took her to hospital. My father gave all the types of tablets to her, um, but she insisted she wanted to go to hospital. While driving, I'm picking up my brother, Siddiqui Rajab, my, my beloved mother asked us to promise to look and take care of our beloved father, Durahim Rajab, and my brother, Wahid Rajab. In that time, when we promised, we still cracked a joke with her, told her, no, ma, everything will be fine, and all that. But the look in her eyes, she's sitting in front of me, but the look in her eyes, she's looking at me while I'm driving, she started to tell you. And I tell I tell you with her, went to the he went into emergency section and my mother, the doctor told us your mother passed on. A water said night for us that night on the seventh of May. My father passed on the twenty seventh of May two weeks apart from my mother. Same thing happened with my father, got sick at home, took him to the hospital. By the time when I came at the hospital, the same doctor was there for my mother, was there for my, for my father. Got the same, exactly the same news in a few months after that, I got married, alhamdulillah, with my beloved wife, Fatima Kulayet. We were married for a year and a few months. Allah granted us our beautiful princesses, our girls, Sharifa Rajab and Shazia Rajab. My beloved wife got to saw them a few days only. Alhamdulillah, Allah granted her all her wishes. Uh, uh, getting married, Allah granted her children, beautiful girls, twins. They were born on the 14th of September. Fatima got very ill but very strong. She was very, very, very strong. My beloved wife, Fatima. Uh, she went for an op, a very, very big op. The 12th of October. For a big op, she came out. She was laying on life support. Allahu Akbar. The 13th of October, she passed on at quarter past six, the evening, the Saturday. I did the kangaroo, I gave the bottles, I, I did all that. My, my girls was in the hospital for two months. This is Janaza was the Sunday. I was, I was literally broken in a million pieces. Wallahi kasam, I was broken in a million pieces. I lost my beloved mother, my beloved father, my beloved wife. She was 38 years old and Allah returned her 
at Allah's place. Beautiful Janaza. I couldn't I couldn't handle it. I left my wife just there laying there. I love it. Like I'm standing here and chatting. It's like I'm feeling it like, like it happened yesterday to me. I've got tears in my eyes. I'm emotional, but Alhamdulillah. Like I always say, the du'as, it's very powerful. I loved my parents. I never, never, never thought my parents is going to leave me so soon. But Allah knows best. You know, sometimes if you hear a song or something or to see people disrespecting their parents, their wives, it hurts me inside. Why? Because I don't have parents no more. I don't have a wife no more. The hardest part is of everything is you alone. There's no mother to run to, there's no father to run to, there's no wife to run to. It's it's for me sleepless nights. Well like some I don't sleep. If I sleep, I sleep an hour or two. Why? Because I miss them too much. Everybody says, you will be fine, you will get through it. Well, like I said, it's tough, it's tough, it's tough. We have learned to realize what life is with your spouse. To love them, to care for them, and keep them in your du'as. Allah's Ghafoor Rahim. Allah knows when you come and when you go. I made peace into my heart to accept it, but when it's Eid, when it's birthdays, when it's Mother's Day, Father's Day, I'm broken into pieces. Qasam Quran. My mother Sharifa, Haji Sharifa Rajab, that's a woman in a million. Wallahi Qasam, it's a woman in a million. She's fun. She's happy. Everything, and she will always have an ear for you when you need her. Even my father, my beloved wife, we were with us for a short period together, but she was very happy, go lucky. She loved me, I loved her. We just had that passion for each other. And I ask Allah every day to grant me the strength and to grant him the highest place in Jannah to fit those. feel sad, I cry, then I will just think of all the good we did together. The only thing I can say is whoever still have parents, your wife, your spouse, treat them with respect, love them, care for them, show them your, your love. Whenever they're not there no more, you will never have the chance again to say, I love you. I'm so grateful. Why? Because I always told my mother, my father, my spouse, whenever I leave or whatever, I will always tell them I love you. Anything can happen. And there Allah proved us anything can happen. You can love that person so much. But in a second that person is gone. My beautiful princesses, 
You will never say that was premature babies. Wallahi kassam. That's how beautiful they grown out. If you can play the Quran, you will sit. And I love the children with my heart and soul. I will give my last breath for them.